Each view component has a special property called repeat with. The repeat with property can be bound to a list of objects type data. The component will then be repeated with the number of objects contained in the data. Here I have created a page variable called list var. The initial value is a list of objects with each object representing a fruit. Now let's bind the repeat with property of this paragraph component to the list var variable. Having done this, we can now see a ghostly trail in the view canvas signifying that this component is being repeated. The paragraph component is repeated for each object in the list. Having the paragraph repeated, we can now bind the other component properties to the data of the list items. Let's bind the paragraph content property and we can see that we can now access a new binding category, property of data item in repeat. Accessing this, we can browse the properties from the schema of the list items. Let's choose the name property and then we can see that the content of each repeated paragraph component is bound to one of the list item properties. Note that the repeat with property can be only bound to a list of objects type data and not for example a list of texts.